right, so just to recap, don't make too many little waves because it's going to be a little bit more of a challenge to try to mirror the wave or to imitate the wave right away. But it can be done. It's just a little bit more of a challenge than you probably want to start with. So remember, you want to imitate the wave and it gets slowly, gradually closer and closer and closer to the edge. And then when it meets the edge, it gets pinched off and you stop. You go to the other side of the edge, back up a little, and you begin again. And it doesn't go big right away. See how it kind of jumps out? It runs along real tight to the edge and it gradually gets larger. Now, this is just a little less of a ribbon like um, eventually when I start adding shading that might help but if you make a bunch of little tight little um, waves it just looks less like a ribbon than if you make bigger waves for right now okay so that's reason number one I'm gonna show you again how to pinch it off and how not to pinch it off so let's start with larger waves Make sure that each wave is not the exact same, because that's boring. And if you find it hard to do that, what you could do is just make dots, you know, and say, okay, each of these dots are at a different height, and then try to draw through them. Okay. And then you draw your second edge like that. So you could just practice doing the edge a couple times. All right. And you should be making these lines lighter. Let me move this up. Okay. So, I can start at the top, but I tend to start down at the bottom. And I have to this time because there's not enough room up here. Um, so, you drop down and you start imitating the wave. And it gets closer and closer. And close. Not like, don't like jump up and like pinch it off like a lump. That's not right. You want to gradually tighten it off so that it meets it slowly. All right. Then you lift up your pencil and you go to the other side of the edge, back up, and you're going to start imitating the wave again, and it's going to get slowly larger. All right. So that is how you draw one twist. Okay, the next technique that you can start is in the next video.